Okay, first match of uh, Night of Champions was a tag title match between the Dust Brothers and Star... No, wait, the Usos versus Star and Gold Dust. Uh, match was okay, actually. It was, uh, like all Gold Dust and Uso matches, you really can't expect anything to be bad, whether they're facing other people or themselves. They always have a very solid match altogether, but for a pay-per-view, it really gets everyone all just excited for, for the show. And um, new tag team champions... Uh, things that stuck out to me, first of all, was Goldust's uh, new face paint. And just, he can do just so much with that, that canvas on his face. And um, whether he's a face, just going classic gold, or when he's a heel, he kind of got the black going on. It's really cool to see. And the ending, you kind of saw the Usos leave in a way that's uh, not typical. I know the camera kind of followed them halfway up the ramp. They had a lot of, uh, it was like a shot from maybe the shoulders up. And I think there might, maybe, you'll see an Uso heel turn because the way the gold, the way that Goldust and Stardust were celebrating, it really led me to believe that you kind of did um, uh, a turn for them being faces and now you just need that official Uso heel turn. And uh, I think it, it might be possible because I know they're probably going to obviously a rematch over the next month or so I can see another tag team rematch at Hell in a Cell so somewhere from tomorrow night on Raw to obviously Hell in a Cell I can see Nuso going on heel heel turn and uh, just another series of matches but that's all new champions it was uh, like I said it was a great match great way to kick off the pay-per-view and um, at first obviously it wasn't I don't know Something with WWE matches, they start off slow and it's like it goes up, they take you up on a ride and then they bring you back down. And uh, it just seems to be like every single match, even the next match that I'll make a video on separately, uh, same thing. Actually, no, I won't make a video on it, but Sheamus versus Cesaro was just the hard-hitting match that I, I expected it to be, really. It was one of the matches I was looking so much forward to, and um, just uppercuts and just pouncing on each other you heard the thud on every single shot and i really didn't expect anything less from these two um like i said it was the match i was looking forward to the most and i always thought like those two european guys going at it with each other is something that i would love to see at wrestlemania uh whether it be a sheamus a wade barrett or um a cesaro any though maybe even a triple threat would be like amazing but Guys who just hit each other, they always seem to be from, from the European countries where that style is really over. And, But yeah, I was expecting Sheamus to lose, but no, I'm, I have no problems with him winning, and he seems to be growing out that beard also, which could also mean a heel turn. Um, but they've been talking about a Sheamus heel turn for, for many months now, so it could be coming up real soon. But that's all. Um, Sheamus retained. Oso's lost. New title tag champions. And uh, that's it. See you guys in the next video.